You ever get a feeling like you're always a couple steps behind, yet you never quite know what to do about it? Hey there, Daniel Hartman, Community Machinery, Sackville, New Brunswick. I just want to share a couple office improvements made here to really keep things refined. And it's not just, you know, because it's a snowstorm outside and it's a Sunday and I wanted to hide out in the workshop. This is stuff that really needed to be done for me because often, I get feelings of anxiety that are overwhelming where I don't get anything done in the day. And the less I carry a to-do list in my mind, the less all of us carry that to-do list in our mind, the more free and spacious we'll have our minds to be able to use thoughts for other things to really serve others, higher value, as well as bring more enjoyment to our lives. So check it out. What we got here is actually just some old scrap wood was laying around that's half inch plywood. That doesn't matter though, you can make this thing out of anything. And some of the, the key features that I found the most important, which is why I built this, is having it at the exact angle so I can see it perfectly right into the bottom of all of these so nothing slips through the cracks. Now, the other key point, I made sure to leave lots of room underneath so I could slide the laptop or if I'm using another computer and there's a keyboard here, the keyboard could slide there and then use a laptop here without having to rearrange everything all the time. Wow, tongue twister. Anyhow, the other key thing, I made it big enough so it fits a clipboard or these file folders and I put these slots in here. As you can see, my hand can reach right into the back without straining because I want to keep this height here as low as possible to keep this compact and move this up and out of the way in order to put as much as possible in a space without making it look like there's no space for anything else. So I'm going to share in a future video when I get these all finished up and labeled the methodology for desktop filing because there is a methodology in terms of inboxes and how to really be able to queue tasks up in a quick and efficient way when we're at the desk. So. Oh, wow, look at that. I don't know how I got that all done. And if you happen to see the meditation stool video that I made, there's another second part that goes along with that that I've been working on. There's a couple of spreadsheets that outline months of the year and how many days in a month and list the goal at the top. See if you can see that a little bit better there. So. This is going to be a huge game changer as far as there's something in our psyche that's really inherently gets feeling rewarded by being able to check things off a list. So that's one thing I'm really working to leverage now. Before I moved into the shop, I did the best ever where for over a month and a half, I got to the gym around 6, 6.30 every morning, put in 20 minutes of cardio and you know did a lot of stretching and, and other exercise over the course of an hour and felt the best I ever felt as far as active in my lifestyle. And I'm not a guy who enjoys or has really grew up enjoying exercise. So it's one of those things I'm still learning. So besides my goal of meditating, I've got a goal on here for 100 jumping jacks and 100 sit-ups every day. And one of the other, the other things I'm really looking to do is to start uh, skipping rope. Because that is one thing that I find to be playful and fun and lighthearted and really captivate that uh, how we all have these inherent child passions and curiosity and things to really get feeling like we're in the flow, we're in the enjoyment of life. So those are a couple of good thoughts that I want to share with you. And over time we can track the progress and there might be a couple of good tips here as far as me seeing myself as a work in progress and that we're all in this thing together. We've all got some huge challenges ahead if we really want to live our best lives and meet the goals we're really feeling the most compelled to. Wow. It's like climbing mountains. <laughs> the goals we really want to excel at. So on that note, please share what you're looking to do in the comments below 
and any kind of improvements, office or shop improvements you'd like to see more detail on, or just something you're thinking about, please comment below and please like, please subscribe if you found anything helpful or enjoyable, and we'll catch you next time. Thanks.